Hey everyone, welcome to Consumer and Personal Finance. I know there's some few questions going on about the careers presentation and what is that and how do I do it? Second, we also have a lot of new students who transferred in in the last day or two or last week. So it may be a bit confusing. So I want to walk everybody through again how you find information in my class. I really have tried to make it very simple for you. So number one, the first thing you do as a student in any class is the first thing you do is go to class link. Okay. Class link is going to pull up your student view. Okay, this is student view. We need this every day. The second is here's your Office 365. Your teachers are emailing you through here. You should be going here to check your email. So first, let's go to student view. You are going to let the magic happen first. And then you're going to go to your class websites on the left. And in your class websites, here are your different classes. So you would click on my class to see my class website. When you do that, this is what you're going to see. So you can see that this has every day of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I even put whether it's an even or odd day. Right here's the agenda. I'm going to go to the week of the 26th. Okay, brand new students who just got in. You are not doing Edgenuity. You are doing EverFi. So you should have contacted me and said, how do I get logged into EverFi? Or shown up to my Zoom and asked me how to get logged into EverFi. So that is your responsibility to ask me how to get into EverFi. I don't think it's fair to put you in Edgenuity in the middle of the semester. So those who started with me, you are doing Edgenuity unless we've discussed doing something else. And so here you can see that it tells you that today was an odd day and here's what we're doing. And tomorrow is an even day. I even do that. My Zoom link is always right there. So anytime you need me, click on this link. Like I'm on this afternoon from one to three. So you can click on this link and get me. If you can't get me, then just email me and say, I'm trying to get on Zoom. Can you Zoom me at two? Yes, give me a specific time, I will. So if you expand this, it shows you exactly what you should be doing or where you should be in Edgenuity. Okay, Edgenuity's done. Everfy, those brand new students who started last week, you did your budgeting last week in Everfy. You're now working on your second module this week. Those who just started today, you're working on budgeting and hopefully you can get caught up to the second module as well. The second piece is I have the hybrid schedule right here. It tells you what time we meet. If you're in my first hour, it's this time, third hour, fifth, seventh, right? It's all right there. Ignore the blue and gold. Okay. Now let's talk about the careers presentation. If you just started my class last week or this week, you are not doing it. Everyone else, you're doing it. Your Edgenuity, when you did careers, said there is a presentation on careers. Ask the teacher for the rubric. We also, if you go here to agenda and go to the week of October 12th, here's your rubric. Hmm. Here's the site you use to research it. And here's an example presentation. I'm even going to show you an example presentation. So you would go to, see if I can get one here. I'm gonna go to an example presentation here for you to see those who have not done it and are like, why do I have an F? I'm gonna go to PowerPoint and I'm gonna pull up this presentation. You just need to research one from the BLS.gov, but you need to be thorough if you want the full 25 points. This is not optional. This is a requirement. Here's a description of what they do. Here's their education, their job outlook, their salary, their cost of living. So you need to be very thorough in your presentation. So if you have no idea what I'm talking about, it means you did not show up to my class on the week of the 12th. You did not read your class website. You also did not check your emails because I've emailed this out to you three times. So use your resources. If you have any additional questions about this, just email me, but please don't